Hello everyone, my name's Silver and welcome back to my channel. Today you guys, I'm going over the Bermuda Triangle Trial Deck Debut of Divas. So as, um, as of last night, this has been updated to a full deck list. And before I go over the card, the new cards in here, which I have up top, across the top of my screen, I just want to take a look at the breakdown of the deck really quickly. So we have 17 grade zeros, which isn't normal, abnormal. We have eight grade threes, which isn't abnormal. But we do have 15 and 10 in different spots, which makes it very unique. Uh, so 15s in grade ones, which is really different, and 10 grade twos. And as you can see right down here along the side, in grade threes, we got three of each grade three, and I'm assuming that's because they aren't top tier like they normally give you a uh, normal like backup unit that you have two of, two of your Vanguard and four of a lesser one. So we're going to start off in the grade three section with Chocho pa Para. Can't ever say that name. I can't ever say half the names of a Vanguard. Um, let's start off with its auto Vanguard skill. Choose one of your other rear guards with Chocho in its name. Put it to the bottom of your deck. When this unit attack hits a vanguard, you may pay the cost. If you do, draw a card. So overall, the effect is decent. It's not over the top. It isn't on hit, so it would be something I would replace immediately. Um, the art for it is nice overall. And I honestly can't wait to uh, pre-order one of these trial decks and get it. So we'll move on to the next unit, which is Chocho. Another name I can't pronounce, and this one has a bit better skill in my opinion. When one of your other rear guards with Chocho in its name is put into deck, this unit gets 3k until end of turn. So with what this deck does, it is actually really nice. And I might actually run this at 4 for a while. Um, probably not because I haven't gone through the uh, um, booster box yet. But can't wait to see what else there is. Moving along, we have our vanilla grade 2 at 10, 10k, which isn't terrible. Chocho Tora, um, yeah. Overall, art's nice. Um, really can't tell. Sorry for the blurry art, but this is all they had. Like, if I enlarge it, it's not a nice, clean image. So I don't know what else to do besides look at blurry art. So yeah, um, this is something I normally remove right away. I don't like vanillas without skills, just cause I just don't like vanillas without skills. It's really weird, even though I know they're helpful at times. We'll move on to the next grade two, which is our unique intercept, or our unique unit in general. Vanguard and rear, if the number of rear guards you have is one or less, this unit gets 2k and five shield. So this makes it a great intercept unit. And yeah, and I believe the skill does go off, uh, nope, it's a rear guards. Oh, it's a rear guard and guard skill, so yeah. If you intercept with it, it gets the 5k if you are only down to one rear. So overall, her art is nice. Um, I probably will end up replacing this just because I don't like uh, um, special intercepts. I don't really use them as a personal opinion. We'll move on to our vanilla grade one, Chocho Sabrina. Overall, the art's nice. There's a... Uh, book or something in her hand that I would like to actually know what it looks like but I don't um overall Annette again it's another unit I end up removing eventually even though I know they're helpful but yeah I like the art we have the perfect guard which I actually really like which is Chocho Kaling and her skill is the is a perfect guard choose a card from hand when this unit is placed on guard circle, you may pay the cost. If you do, one of your units that's being attacked cannot be hit until under turn. So what's nice about this unit is it goes back to its roots of it not being, not needing to be a um, one the vanguard two. Um, it can be placed from deck. So if you're running quintet walls, it actually works really nice. Moving along to the next grade one, which is Chocho Rizalia. I don't know. Um, when this unit's placed on rear, choose one of your other units with Chocho in its name and give it 3k. So we have a nice power booster. So you play 
you're able to get a lot off with her. Yeah. So, yeah, overall, the art's nice. Her skill isn't half bad. I plan on running her in, for a while until I can buy a actual booster box of Bermuda Triangle to increase my deck. And then we just have the basic triggers, which we have the critical, which I really like its art. I'm not going to go too much into these. We have the stand trigger. Again, its art looks nice. Um, I like this art a lot because it's like, oh no, look at little medical assist. But, um, and then obviously we have the draw trigger, which we get, which allows you to get 3k for popping it into soul. So we get a nice resource replenisher, and I believe we get four of all of these. So overall, it's not bad. I'm really excited, and I can't wait to see what the deck holds for us. But guys, I've been Silver. I will see you all later. Enjoy your day. Peace.